by far, let's set one up base number three of the women's division. You got it, Brandon. It will feature the 2017 women's division champion, Pauline Carter, Rona Hawkman, I'm the Hawkman sisters, and Emily Hatter. So, without further ado, it's back to the end, of course. Everyone's on the clock, so without further ado, please start the race! Alright, so in this next race, Rona Hawkman looks to follow up from her exciting Week 18 victory from last week's episode, while Pauline Carter and Emily Heffer try desperately to get wins on the board. Who will get to be a winner this week here in Rio Nevada? Which one of these will pay off their gamble? Right now, it is Pauline Carter who is going to have control of the lead. Rona Hartman is not too far behind in second place. And it looks like Pauline Carter and Mora Hartman are going to be heading for the water. As the first superstar to get speed is number seven. Now she's heading for the water. And guess who's already getting left behind in the competition? It's number eight, not Sue. Seems like number one also really needs some help. He's also getting left behind in the competition. Well, I do believe one of them should get speed burst number two. And it will be number eight who will have control of speed burst number two. Rona Hopman has a commanding lead over Pauline Carter. They are making their way towards the sapphire portion of the young course. And who got the next command to be us? It's number one, who desperately needs to catch up every now and then. Right now, Pauline Carter is trying her best to catch up to Rona Hopman, while Emily Heffer is trying her best to defend third place over a couple of sewage shots in the back. And we have passed one minute mark, soon to be 110, Right about now, as the next speedbus we made by number eight. That makes his second speedbus in the race. And we'll get out. He got all of that one. Now he's catching up to the other child in a hurry. Poor number one, meanwhile, is still getting left behind in the competition in the back. And down he goes for the count. I do believe it's time for number one to get speedbus. But that next speedbus is going to be made by. Number six, who's trying desperately to lead over the pies of a chow. And might not Warner Hartman is starting to get tailgated by Pauline Carter. They have reached the top of the wall, and we'll soon know which one of them will prevail at the home stretch. In fact, we're about to find out right now, by the way, looks like yep. Ronald Hartman takes the next to MSPS, trying desperately to keep the lead over Pauline Carter. And number one is gonna be missing coming up the wall. He's gonna have no help at all. Next BS belongs to Emily Hafer. And right now she is going to make the pass on number 8 who is sitting in the coming win. But Rona Hartman has this race all wrapped up, ladies and gentlemen. Our number 5 victory for Rona Hartman, right? Looks like, yeah. And number 2 takes the next BS. Paul Lee Carter won't have enough just to catch up tomorrow, up in their time. Rona Hartman holds on Paul Lee Carter to earn an amazing victory here with the Challengers in the universe. Paul Lee Carter will have to start off for a second place. And we have just enough time for one more speed bus of this race. And we may buy, and we have a that makes her second speed bus of the race. But it's Mona Hartman who now jumps to five wins in her star season. That's right, good star season so far for Mona Hartman. And there's more as I actually coming up. Do not go anywhere.